What's going on you guys? It's D-Machine bringing you another top 5 list today. Today I'm going over my top 5 best WoW Arena tournament moments. Number 5. BlizzCon 2011 Grand Finals. The South Korean team OMG vs Skillcap representing the United States. This memorable moment I chose was the very last game out of a best of 5. Skillcap running Mage Lock Paladin versus the OMG's team Paladin Hunter DK. They came back from a 0-2 deficit, evening up the score 2-2 two two, uh, with some seriously close, close games. Uh, these guys put a lot of work into coming back and then ultimately lost the whole thing and Snuts was just devastated. So this is going to be my fifth most memorable moment in WoW tournament history. Snuts are too scattered, there's the portal, and they do not... Play it out. Wow. The what an exciting mage. finals. South Korea they are. Are. You are champion. We saw that coming. Number four. It's the 2011 North American Invitationals, and Reckful is feeling the pressure and, quote, letting everyone know how he feels. Wow, no grip peel from Reckful. Alex trying his best to peel, but the team of Complexity really coming out strong here on Digit. Yeah! And Digit going down to 15k, absolutely Fucking nothing God. left. Calling, Turtle please, please it. kill him. Goes into Ghost Wolf, into a stun, out of it. There's that late trick, yeah! and the fill goes down yeah! in the middle of the ring. Yeah, that was... <laughs> All right, that Reckful means... letting everyone now, know how he feels. Number three, the Intel Extreme Masters Tournament. Orange Marmalade is alone. Both of his teammates are dead, and he's sticking around in this game against a healer and another mage. The casters have no faith in him whatsoever, and I honestly wouldn't either. Uh, he sticks around with a slight chance of coming back, and ultimately gets a barrage proc with all of his cooldowns, and kills the mage in 2v1s in a major tournament kills that they need to claim victory and SK Gaming despite having to fight against a very resilient orange marmalade are going to be the champions <laughs> are going to be your winners but look at a counter kill this is incredible oh my God. Quana got way too aggressive got in there orange marmalade blew all of his cooldowns he had the mana he got a clear I've cast never been proc. so impressed orange marmalade turned that on his head SK Gaming were playing like they won they went in and were like, this guy, you know, he's just messing with us. He's literally just playing with our feelings. He's only doing this to annoy us, to stop us walking over that finish line. But in actual fact, Orange Marmalade from HON could pull out the best victory that has ever been seen at a tournament. But not only that, to save his team. Number two, Complexity Black versus Red. A very, very memorable moment throughout the whole WoW community and is still talked about today. Where this Beast Cleave instantly kills one of the best mages in the world, just about instantly. It wasn't even really fair. Venruki the mage still jokes about this moment to this day and even has a subscriber emote dedicated to it. Wow, and down goes Venruki! Headshot, and that'll do it! And uh, now Venruki's wondering where exactly that block key is, but it didn't really matter. No, no, that... You know what? I wouldn't have even expected that much damage to come out. I mean, we were following Flex from the start. And my number one favorite WoW Arena tournament moment is a beautiful representation of why I like to watch competitive WoW Arena. 2014 Armageddon Finals Game 1 Skill Caps LSD versus Venruki Snuts and Sidu team, the three amigos. LSD in dampening is a force to be reckoned with. They are insane. The pressure from the Warlock and the instant procs of an Elemental Shaman make this team very scary to stay in line of sight when dampening is effect. Seedu, uh, in preparation of this, got a Spirit Staff to contradict that mana cost of having to heal through dampening. And then Benruki and Snuts did a great job setting up a kill and finding that opener without Sham Rage on Talbadar to ultimately land the kill and take the whole tournament 3-0. 
pay as well. The Nature's Guardian is going to proc from Talbotar. Everyone's so, so low. How are they still alive? There's the heals coming in from Channel, but it's not going to be enough. I think he's going to go down. He's at 20k. Channel 3k. He goes down. And three amigos. Are you kidding me? They're going to take wow. first blood in the grand finals. Wow. Absolutely wow. unreal play. <laughs> that was Sinu, Ben Ruki, and such. Maybe the best game I have ever seen. That is. That was incredible back and forth, especially when Three Amigos was really pushed behind those pillars. Sidu barely hanging on. That last link, the ascendance on top of it, dispelling UAs when his entire team is down uh, below half with that huge dampening. We had 30 seconds remaining in that game when the kill was scored. I just, I just didn't even think it was possible to heal through that. I'm actually astounded. Yeah. Um, it just, uh, Sidu played like a god. I mean, yeah. Thanks for watching guys, that's going to conclude my video for today. If you enjoyed it, please hit that subscriber button, helps me out a bunch, and I will see you next time. D-Machine, blast off. We're on the top 5 best cops, in my opinion. Number 5 on my list, KFC or something like that, you're going to see Monks often switching this talent up for healing elixirs that heal the monks.